If you are struggling with a leaking concrete roof, don't worry. In this video, I will take you through an easy to understand, step-by-step -step process to fix and prevent concrete roof leaks effectively. A leaking roof can cause serious damage to your home, and if not treated in time, it can weaken the structure. So let's dive in and learn how to repair it properly. If you are a civil engineering or construction professional, this channel will come in handy to you. Let's dive in. Step 1. Understanding the cause of roof leakage. Before we start repairing, we must understand why concrete roofs leak. Concrete is naturally porous, meaning it absorbs water over time. Some common reasons for leakage are cracks in the concrete due to expansion and contraction, poor waterproofing during construction, clogged drainage systems causing water pooling, plumbing issues leading to water seepage, age-related wear and tear. Now that we know the common causes, let's move to the inspection phase. Step 2. Inspecting the roof for damage. To fix the leak, we first need to find its source. Here's how you can do a proper inspection. Check for visible cracks on the surface of the concrete. Look for water stains or damp spots inside the building. Inspect plumbing lines and drainage systems for leaks or blockages. Check if water is pooling on the roof after rain. Examine the roof edges, corners, and joints, as they are common leakage points. If the damage is extensive, calling a professional for help is always a good idea. But if you feel confident, let's move to the repair process. Step 3. Cleaning the roof surface. Before any repair, it's important to clean the roof properly. Use a pressure washer to remove dirt, dust, and debris. Scrub off any algae or moss growth, as these can retain moisture. Allow the roof to dry completely before applying any sealant. Step 4. Sealing the cracks and leakage points. Once the roof is clean, it's time to seal the cracks and fix the leakage points. Here are some effective methods. 1. Using roof cement or mortar. Fill the cracks with a cement-based patching compound or roof cement. Apply a roof primer and let it dry. Use an elastomeric sealant for extra protection. 2. Epoxy or acrylic resin sealants. If cracks are deep, inject epoxy resin to fill and bond the cracks. This method provides long-term strength and prevents further leaks. 3. Silicate-based waterproofing. Silicate-based sealants react with concrete to form a waterproof barrier. They penetrate deep into the concrete, making it more resistant to moisture. 4. Polyurethane sealant for expansion joints. For construction joints and expansion gaps, a non-sag polyurethane sealant works best. It remains flexible, preventing cracks from forming again. 5. Applying a protective screed. A cement screed mixed with waterproofing admixtures can add an extra layer of protection. Use a ratio of 1 is to 1 to 1 is to 4 for better durability. Step 5. Waterproofing the entire roof. Once the cracks are sealed, it's time for waterproofing. This is a crucial step to ensure long-term protection. You can choose from the following methods. 1. Elastomeric waterproof coating. A flexible waterproof coating that expands and contracts with temperature changes. Apply two coats for best results. 2. Bituminous or coal tar layer. This method creates a strong, waterproof membrane over the roof surface. Commonly used for industrial and large commercial buildings. 3. Installing waterproof tiles or slabs. Tiles with sealed joints prevent water from penetrating the surface. Marble slabs can also provide a decorative and protective layer. 4. Waterproofing membranes. These are sheets of waterproof material that are installed over the concrete surface. Available in liquid applied or sheet applied versions. We have already made a video on types of waterproofing materials for concrete roofs. Check out the link to the video on the card above or in the description. Step 6. Common mistakes to avoid. Many homeowners make mistakes that reduce the effectiveness of roof repairs. Avoid these common pitfalls. Skipping cleaning before applying waterproofing materials. Using the wrong sealant that doesn't bond well with concrete. Ignoring minor cracks, which can expand over time. Applying only one coat of waterproofing instead of multiple layers. De delaying repairs. Allowing damage to worsen. 
not checking drainage systems, leading to water pooling on the roof, using cheap, low-quality materials that may not last long, failing to perform routine inspections, which can catch small problems early, improper application of waterproofing coatings, such as uneven layers or missing spots, emergency fixes for leaking roofs, if you have an emergency leak and need a quick fix before a full repair, try these temporary solutions. Use plastic sheets or tarps to cover the leaking area. Apply silicone sealant for small cracks. Use bitumen patches for urgent waterproofing. Place absorbent materials indoors to minimize water damage. Before you start your roof repair, it's good to have an idea of the costs involved. Here's a rough estimate. Basic crack sealing. Budget around $10 to $50 for small fixes. Waterproof coatings. A more protective solution ranging from $100 to $500 depending on the area. Bitumen or waterproof membrane installation. A long-term fix that can cost between $500 to $2,000. Now let's talk about the materials you'll need. Roof cement or epoxy resin to seal those stubborn cracks. Waterproof sealants for an extra layer of protection. A pressure washer to ensure the surface is clean before applying anything. A trowel and brush for smooth and precise application. Having the right materials and budget in mind will make the repair process smoother and more effective. Regular maintenance to prevent future leaks. Fixing the leak is not enough. You must maintain your roof regularly to prevent future leaks. Here are some maintenance tips. Inspect the roof twice a year, before and after the rainy season, to identify early signs of damage. Clean the drainage system to prevent clogging, as standing water can weaken the roof structure over time. Check for new cracks, loose waterproofing layers, or signs of wear and tear, and seal them immediately to prevent further water penetration. Reapply waterproof coatings every few years to enhance protection and prolong the life of your roof. Keep an eye on tree branches hanging over your roof, as falling leaves and debris can clog drainage systems and promote water retention. Ensure proper slope and drainage design to prevent water from pooling, as stagnant water can cause premature roof deterioration. Monitor interior ceilings and walls for signs of moisture or water stains, as they can indicate early leakage issues. Repairing a leaking concrete roof is not as difficult as it seems if you follow these steps properly. However, if you are unsure or the damage is severe, always consult a roofing professional. I hope this guide helped you understand the process in a simple and practical way. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips on home maintenance and repair. If you are a civil engineering or construction professional or a homeowner, this channel will come in handy to you. Remember, every time you subscribe, a leaky roof somewhere gets fixed. See you in the next video.